sound test one, two, one, two. I don't know why you say sound test, it's audio sync. Whatever, go fuck yourself. Right, right. Please leave all of that in. Okay. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to the Salt Shaker Trio's adventures in Dank Souls 3. Here at the helm is Jordan with Kyle. Hello. And Kim. Hey. A little, uh, a little, little story. Um, this virgin playthrough has been deflowered, basically, uh, in the interest of time. And in the interest of time, in the interest of time, we aren't doing that anymore. Uh, so I have now beaten this game and come back for seconds. And still get hit by that shit lord, but, you know. Yeah, so the basics were that we were looking at how long it took us to get how far, and it would have taken us much longer without... So Jordan has beaten the game in the interest of speeding this up for all of you guys at home. Because I, in our first recording session, there are, I think, three episodes where we accomplish dick. So, now things go a little faster, but Jordan still sucks. So. It's true. So, it's a different kind of fun. Ooh. Goonie shot. <laughs> no, 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 it's fine. I just want What this. the hell is that? It's uh, the increased bonfire level. Oh. Whoop! Wow. What the You fuck? ran the wrong way. That's not where you jump back. <laughs> it's 500 souls. I don't need it. Also, in the time that we didn't record this, Jordan left this game to me and I beat it. Yep. So we if beat Jordan it. sucks too hard, then I will take over. Fuck mm -hmm. off. <laughs> Don't suck, then. Well, you know that's not going to happen. I mean... So, there is, there's a fun story. So, um, I was playing this game, of course, and I, uh, I got to a point with my second character, and I was wondering, like, why the fuck does my health not go up? Like, I keep putting points in Vitality, which is always the health stat. Oh. Why is my health not going oh, up? no. <laughs> and then eventually, like, I'm like, wait, the top stat is Vigor. And I put a stat in it, and my health went up, and I'm like, no! No! And so I suck. In this it's game, Vitality, all Vitality does is increases your equipment load. Oh, does it? Yep. yep. <laughs> Jump in. Why? I'm gonna get hit. Ooh, I'm getting hit a lot. You're getting gang raped, bro. So you've beaten this game already. Yep. Does not show. <laughs> uh, this part is a shit show. No, no matter what you do. It's it's really not. Also, in the um, interests of just making it a little more entertaining for himself, Jordan did play his other character as a different build than we will be using. I played uh, two separate builds. The build where I didn't put anything into health was actually a faith build, and I quit. So then I made a dex <laughs> build. No, literally, I got... I That's like, why there's four characters on Yeah, me. I put like six hours into the game as faith, and then got so mad when, um, when I didn't gain health and then figured out what I did wrong that I made another character. I was like, fuck this game. <laughs> he just pouted and reset the whole game. Yep. Mm, yep. That's incredible. You should just go with the almighty luck build that I have. Oh, God, I'm not doing... I mean, it's good, people. He's not wrong, but I won't. I heard about the one build. I haven't seen it yet. It's, it sounds amazing, though. It, it's... It's, uh... Base stats, everything except for health and endurance, and then just all luck. <laughs> oh, Jesus. You, I, I stopped luck at 60. Is that the soft cap? Uh, pretty much, yeah. Oh, I thought you just rolled off a cliff. Oh. What is in... Is it just a bushel of apples that he has there? That's, I have no idea. uh... Some kind of meat. A bushel of people meat? Yeah, it's probably people. Are you going to try to join as much as many companies as you can in this one, or no? Uh, no. Not in the least. I have decided that since the the overall critique that I have heard is that we should do this faster, I am going to play this fast and dirty. Okay. In the Jordan way, so it's still going to be like a 25-hour playthrough. But I was going to say, so still pretty slow. But... Are you going to be fighting Nameless King? Uh, I I mean, we can try. Will gentlemen have to do it? I mean, it'd be funnier if the gentleman did it. Okay. We we should leave the gentleman as a mystery to okay. the fans. Who oh, is no. the true gentleman of Dank Souls? The gentleman is okay. The gentleman is okay. That's that's the real thing. Um we're going to go fight one of my least favorite bosses, actually, in any Dark Souls game. Not for any, like, uh, 
not for any fight purposes, even though the fight itself is kind of awful, but because he is just, like, aesthetically really awful as well. I think he looks stupid. You had to beat his nutsacks. Yeah, it's gonna be great. Oh, this boss. It's okay. a high-quality boss fight. Um, it's, it's like, a boss made of feces. Let's, let's be No, clear. it's not. That is not what it looks like. It, no, but it's, like, it, it is the same quality level of, like, let's make a poo boss. Like, it's, it's... Yeah. Hey, man, the only poo boss of note ever... Look at this inconspicuous tree. There's two. Look at it. It's so inconspicuous. Which yeah, but... tree? Okay, that one's small. Look at that big, inconspicuous tree. <laughs> Fuck you in particular. Oh, no. Did it get up? Ah, it's got... It, it has some great wood. Who... Uh, <laughs> who... Who, honestly... Who... At... At the... The development company... Oh, FromSoft? FromSoft. Was like, you know... We've had a lot of high-quality bosses... We've had a lot of really interesting designs, but what if we made an Ent with a ball sack? How about that, guys? And they were like, oh, hilarious. Oh my god, so many things just died. Yeah, and one of them luckily... Hey, hey, look, look. look. From Software made Metal Wolf Chaos. The best game ever made. That did not ever come out to the States. For strange reasons. Because, no, it didn't come out in the States because uh, they thought... Uh, Westerners would make fun of it. They thought they would, like, oh, this game's awful, this and that. Which, they're right, but they're also incredibly wrong. Because we would have loved it. We would have loved it. <laughs> because Metal Wolf Chaos, for those of you that haven't seen it, please just. I don't think you can hit oh, it. Oh, you can't yet. hit it yet. Okay. You gotta hit his penis before you hit his asshole. Um. Oh! Metal Wolf Chaos is the greatest love letter to America that has ever been written by another country. Oh, oh You play you as doing? the president of America. Huh. That was weird. Oh, shit. Oh, oh he's man. dropping the, the stuff. Yeah! It still always looks like you put it in his butt. It really does. Oh, yeah, so another fun fact about this game. Oh, uh, wow, wow, I died. What, that hit you? That was some really long range on that. It, well, the range is pretty long. <laughs> he did the dick! <laughs> yeah, he hates his friends. Um, I've never been hit by that move before. I'm disappointed in myself. The stomp? I, yeah, that move doesn't track well at all. So I'm like, oh, I'll just dodge roll, and then it decided to track this time. It tracks well enough. A fun fact about this game is you don't need the stats to use the shield. The required stats on it does not... You don't need to have it to use it. Uh, okay. Oh, really? We're going to yep. do something real quick that's going to make this a little better. Uh, we are going to reallocate my... Some things just died. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say. Hopefully I get their souls. No, you already left. Oh, well, whatever. Nerds. Yeah, I, uh, when I played through this game, uh, I, I went through 70% of the game on my first playthrough without a shield... <laughs> Oh, wow. Because I uh, I didn't know you didn't need the stats to use it, so I decided to, to go without a shield, and I used something. I used the Cestus so I could parry. That would have been Jordan Rage quitting the game, never playing it again. And then I, I played through it on another character, and I after I had figured out you didn't need the stats to use the shield, and then I, I played through it, I was like, how the hell did I do this without a shield this whole time? Do I have <laughs> anything to upgrade this? You have no souls. Well, yeah, but I could probably pop a soul. So wait, you can just allocate... How many charges the different flasks have whenever you want? Yep. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, it's because if, uh, if you're Jordan and you'll never use magic. Hey, whoa, 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 don't don't teleport. Burn the the shard that you got. Oh, yeah. Right there. Why did you leave the menu? Jordan has beaten the game. You know what? I've tried to forget. <laughs> Just it has been quite place. a long time since our last recording session for this. Um, do I have another one? No. Nope. Okay. I wonder if I... You no, I don't... Boom shot. I don't have the other... I don't have another uh, Estus shard either, I'm uh, sure, so... Probably not. Knowing me. There's there's a way to get a secret Estus shard, but everyone's probably seen it, so I'm not going to do that for the channel, quite frankly. Well, you should get it anyway, because you're probably going to need it. Well, I don't want to get it. It takes forever. No, it doesn't. You have to do a stupid jump. And admittedly, I suppose you guys can make fun of me the entire time I'm doing the stupid jump. So go for the jump. I don't know what it is. Show me. <sighs> <I'm> not... <sighs> yes, for other people at home, I still have not touched this game as I have no 
I gain no enjoyment of actually playing these games. He's lying because he's literally playing right now. No, being in the he's game is not playing it. the game. You know, this is just like having Jordan's brain instead of Kyle's body. Oh, no. That's horrible. We... we no. God, it just... This is what it, this is what we're looking at right now. Poor Kyle. I'm so sorry. How can Your I, brain took such a downgrade. How can I enjoy this game when there are no shotguns? <laughs> it's own. It's not even cool, <laughs> like, um... Like, oh, does it always just put your souls at the fog door? It's, it's not supposed to. Yeah, it really oh, isn't. Okay. Um, oh, maybe it puts you back a few seconds of where you died. Maybe because he teleported there and back, it did no, that for him. No, it should not no. matter. Oh, okay. That's actually well. Here, before it comes weird. alive, let's get a really good shot Sweet. of the tree. There's the tree. It's um. Look at all those pretty sacks hanging from it. I feel like for a boss of this size, it's almost better to just not have your shield out. Uh, like why wouldn't you just two-hand it? Because uh, two-handing it doesn't really improve the damage that much. Oh it no! Really does. Yeah, it's no. like maybe ten points of damage if you're lucky. All the two-handing really does is just changes the way your attack is, like if you swing it variable or not. Oh okay. Yeah, harder. So there probably are some enemies and bosses that that's a smart thing to do, but this one large and hard. For this one, it would be wise to two-handed because some of those little sacks is in a higher to reach, like, high place. Oh, so okay. if you swing vertically by two-handing it, you'll reach it. Guess what? Phase two. You've already done so much damage. I'm so disappointed that I died to this boss. <laughs> I'm super pissed. <laughs> he just... Well, yeah. Oh, okay. This is what happens. Yeah, I assume... I was going to say... Fall damage is suspended! Yeah, it's a scripted event. Get in the chair. Pop that one. Okay, now... This is the part where it's just like, what? Why does he have a prehensile dick hand? Why not? What? Okay. So, next question: Do you think the rape tree from Evil Dead feels really bad about itself and bought like a big car after this guy, or like a big house, or a big dog? I would argue that the rape tree in Evil Dead never felt bad about anything in its life. Nah, man. Look at how. But it's so, it's so small in comparison to his prehensile dick hand. Come on. I mean, we know why the ant wives left now, at least. So, ugh. come on. So, can, are you not supposed to stand in the pollen or whatever that it is? It hurts you. It's poison, basically. Oh, yeah. Okay. Coming around from the compass. You got really unlucky that he did it twice so soon. Yeah. It just. Oh, he's gonna back up on me. Am I on the right side? I'm on the wrong side. Oh, oh wow! My hand. Got him. <laughs> oh, got me again. Oh. Oh. Now do you see why I keep the shield out? Hey man, I beat this without a shield. Uh -huh. I'm kidding, man. Good at everything. No. He's lying. Bad folks. at math. How are you bad at math? Uh -huh. You're better than I am, which is insane. I have no idea actually how good your math skills are, quite frankly. Uh, one plus one equals three. Ah, well there we go. There. Oh, the proof no. is in the proverbial pudding. Ah, good. This boss seems more obnoxious than difficult. This boss yep. is just really annoying. It's not fun to fight. Nope. Depending on your luck, like you may not be able to attack it all if you keep doing this shit. Yep, which it sure is. If you had a project, nice dodge. If you had a projectile of some sort, you could. Could you not just throw the daggers? At the this actually was a really easy fight on my magic user. Huh? Uh, I don't know how. I don't know. How to make it pop faster? I'm not sure if it's based on hits or damage. Oh, oh, I might be dead. Oh no, please don't die. Oh, okay, yeah, you're still alive. Mm. Oh, I was gonna say, what if we just slapped him again? Slap, slap, slap. Clap, clap, clap. This is the Stick fight. The hand. He's I, dead, he's dead. Yay. This fight is definitely one of the ones while playing through the game that when I beat it, I'm like, I am so happy I didn't do this from the channel the first time. Dude, that fight took me three or four tries and each try was like 30 minutes oh wow because yeah, it's it's either. a trial and error fight like i didn't know about half the weak spots really um so now so we're gonna do was something that special. an optional boss then yes. yes you don't have to fight it so here's a sacrificial altar uh it's basically a, a covenant i don't know if i have any shackles no nope, sure don't so vertebra shackles wait the, which covenant is this uh is this the mountain well, there's yeah there's the the corpse 
you have to join this before you do the fight, don't you? Uh, you do, but you can still turn in stuff at the cover. Ah. Yeah. So Kyle's gonna go back. Lit! Um. Uh, Kyle's gonna go back a level, and we're gonna put some points in health, because I'm pretty sure that, uh, we haven't done any of that yet. <laughs> because I thought vitality was health. Whee! Uh. You know you don't have to always go back to that first tab, right? To go back to Firelink Shrine? Is it the, is it at the It's bottom? always at the very bottom of all oh. the other tabs. Don't worry, folks. I'm not good at anything else, either. <laughs> so, rest your minds at ease. Uh, we're actually going to use... So, for funsies, we're going to go to the weapon guy. Special weapon? And I'm going to show you a weapon that I hope to use at some point, even though it's going to be awful. Because that boss fight gives you... Um, Is that King Joffrey? Yeah, there's Joffrey. Does he not have any legs? Uh... I don't see any. I ain't got no legs. <laughs> I got no legs. Lieutenant Diane. <laughs> he either that or he's just like sitting on them, but I doubt it. Begin no, in this position. So this is Dark Souls. these are both. Uh, these are both Dex weapons. You get them from the tree. I'm not going to use either. But this, that's Vort's hammer. Oh, Vort, your best friend. I'm gonna use it, <laughs> even though it's. I have no. I'm not gonna use it actually. But when I get the points to, I'll probably try it at least once. And then, since the other two are dex weapons... You can't use it now? No, it requires like 30 or 40 strength, it's I think. 30. Yeah, so it's... Not it, even close. Oh. What yeah. are we at? 17. Oh, okay. What? Nice. It's just 13 levels of ignoring all your other stats? And Which just... he won't do. Yeah, I, I will not. Because <laughs> he's I, a coward. I've considered, actually, since this is however many times me using this, playing this game, rather, just putting them all in strength, because there's a strength weapon we get soon that I kind of want. When Jordan saw me play the game one day, he's just like, how do you play like this? And I just put all my stats into whatever I wanted because at the time. Because Kim would just take hits like glass. Like, oh my god, he took a hit, and oh, I was like, you, Kim, stop! Like, you glass cannon the whole dude, game. Well, butthole it, clenching. It, just, it depends on what I was going for, like, oh, I need the stats for these weapons. I don't need the health. I <laughs> go oh, straight okay. for the stats. Okay, so that's at 12. Endurance, yep. This, I put so many into Vite, I fucking suck so bad. So um, is there any way we could reallocate the there stats is, There is an NPC in this game will let you redo your stats, but that's not until later. Yep, so we are stuck with that, and I'm actually, I'm not going to put as many points in health. Uh, I'm going to play this a little fast and loose. You know, I, I gotta say, I am kind of bummed that... We didn't get that revelation of Jordan's on camera. Oh God. I know. Because the salt, I'm sure he was like, break your control levels of angry, and I would have loved to see that much salt. It was, it was, I almost quit. I almost, I almost legitimately just quit the game. I'm like, <laughs> it was after the poison swamp too, by the way. Spoilers, there's a poison swamp. There's a poison swamp. It's coming up, and it is a hooker's asshole. Oh yeah, there's also an order you should go through this game in. I learned that the hard way, so I went through a lot of hard <laughs> bosses, and I came back to the other pass or to the other bosses. Like, why are these guys so easy? <laughs> in the entirely the wrong order, because oh, because if you don't go in the order that it intends you, you reach a gate that you cannot continue unless you get an item from a certain boss. Oh wow! Yeah, so I got to this gate. I was like, oh, by the way, on the way to the gate, there's this big, big mean monster. That you could either fight or run away from. I was running down the bridge and I saw this weird, like, uh, weird veil. Because it's a barrier, essentially, that you can't pass. That's the gate I'm talking about. And I saw the gate. I was like, oh, that must be the safe place. I guess I'll try fighting this monster. I killed the monster. I was like, alright, cool, that wasn't so bad. And then I go to the gate and I was like, you can't pass. I was like, god damn it. <laughs> I had to run all the way back. <laughs> run away, run away from the bullshit. Dude, they just want to share their pot with you. Hey, fresh pot! No. Fuck them. Fuck them forever. Did either of you... The only thing I've actually seen in this game, did either of you complete the Onion Man side quest? No, I but I hear am, it's amazing. I'm on the verge of doing so on my second oh. character. There they are. There's the dag. Look at these invincibility <laughs> frames. <laughs> Woo! I'm so strong. Woohoo! Here's Onion Man. Here's Onion Man. Yeah, Onion Man! Get off the elevator. Get off the elevator, you piece of shit. Oh, oh, derp, 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 derp. Aha! Okay, Invisible wall. <laughs> this is weird. This is weird because a couple times I've gone in here, I had those guys chase me, but a fog door appeared at the door and didn't let them in. It hey happened guys. only once where a fog door happened. 
Bye. <laughs> oh no, I'm your man. Dude, that guy's gonna fuck him up. <laughs> I watched him get hit. What? Yeah, what if they kill him right now? They won't. Yeah, they, they won't attack now that I'm not there. Um, right, so are you just trying to get them to go away before you talk to him? Uh, no, you you don't talk to him. Bas basically, you find him uh, somewhere else, like in this tower again. And so then you fight something, and then it continues the quest line. This next fight sucks, by the way. What, this thing? Yeah, I hate you this You can guy. cheese him. Well, you can cheese him, but that's so lame. Just cheese him. You yeah. also could have just not picked that up Just right cheese away. him. Go for the door and cheese him. We don't have time to waste. We have all the time. No, we we don't. We really don't. We really don't. Just oh, it's just cheese it's him. frostbite. It's more of our favorite. Yeah, where you don't get your endurance uh, back. These guys are such cowards. They want me to cheese this guy? I never said cheese. Just cheese him. I don't want to be waiting here forever. Thirty-five throwing knives. <laughs> so for Whoa, whatever reason, he cannot rate. pass through the gate. I, I don't think thirty-five is going to be enough. Wow. Why did that? Why did that stop him? Whoa, what's wrong with the frame rate? I, it's probably trying to load both areas at the same time. <laughs> die, nerd, die! Since when oh I my god, they throw so fast! Why have, I become, why have I become Naruto? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, so. it's the stuttering is probably so both um, trying to load both areas at once. What? Nice kick to the butt. Oh, well, fuck him. Hey, nerd. <laughs> I really hate the controls in this game sometimes, because sometimes you're walking forward, you want to walk forward and hit him, but you get, a, you get the dumb kick instead. Yep. And sometimes that's fatal against the boss. Uh, you, you remember what Frostbite does from yeah, last time, Jordan? Of your course. Stamina is gonna... Oh. Don't die. I didn't. Yay, go me. Yay, I love that straight sword, and I'm never gonna use it. You didn't like the bonfire, did you? Nope, sure didn't. <laughs> You didn't like the thing. I gambled and won. Fuck yourself. Uh, never gamble and lose, kids. You need new shorts. Yep. Kyle would need new armor. Did you know Knight shat in their armor? Well, yeah, yeah we, it off? we did this. We talked about yeah, this. Yeah, we before. talked about this. Well, it would take I like long. to remind people that Kyle would be shitting in his armor right now. Fuck yeah, I would. You know how long that shit takes to put on? Do you also off? know that it wasn't. You that brought this up, it was Kyle, and he was the one that was going, hey, you know what? I'd be shitting myself, and you'd be freaking out, Jordan. You I, freaked out. I wouldn't have liked that. You freaked out in that episode. Do you know what they do? After the fact, they jumped. They dumped water on your entire outfit while you're still wearing it. Uh, hey, look, it's a thing. Hey, where'd uh, he go? Oh, whoops. What you, oh, you Jordan. Wrong one. Oh my lord. No, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I wonder where he went. He Onion Man. I wonder if he rode the top of the elevator back up. Maybe. Hmm. Are you gonna talk to the giant too, so he helps you? Yeah. I mean, he's not gonna do. He's not going to do much helping me. For he the most helps part. you in the is other it, place. Is it more than the dog in Resident Evil Four? Uh, he only helps. You, he helps you in two places. One place we're never going to go back to. Yep, because I already got the one thing I care about in that spot. Nice. Yep, I got the undead ash, which helps. Uh, it's not ash; it's bone shard. Oh, whatever. You turn it into ash. Let's talk. Is the onion man up here now? He's mm -hmm. right there. Okay. Yep. Talk to him at some point because he is. I love that his voice and character and all that stuff. Okay. Well, I have to. I have to go find him again. I don't remember where he. It's exactly. really not that hard. You just jump off the elevator before you get to the bottom. See, this cool giant guy is actually a throwback, kind of, to another character. A new time. Uh, who was in the DLC, which I actually just recently saw, of um. Oh, wait, there's an item up here. Of uh, Dark Souls 1, which is really cool. Uh, he's an NPC who helps you, and he fucking murders a dragon. It's awesome. But is it? Nah, I don't give a shit. It's not even that good of an item. Don't care. Don't care. Kyle doesn't care anymore. Kyle's having enough of this shit. Uh, I think we've all had enough. We we have it on record okay, where that is I it? would spend time there, probably. How do I do it? Jump off. Where? Oh. You missed it. <laughs> Thanks, Kim. <laughs> <sighs> well, now I'm not going to rekindle, but now I have to get it on the elevator. That sucks. Just go talk to Onion Man. No, I don't care. I really sincerely don't care. I do. The people do. No, oh, they don't. He's fun. Mm. You get a ring that regenerates your uh, stamina faster if you go down there. His quest line is awesome. Oh, my God. I've never done his quest line. It's awesome. Cool. His quest line involves the boss fight. Which boss? 
Uh, do you want to spoil it? Yeah, <laughs> let's not spoil it. It's the it's super cool though. I'm trying to think which boss he's been beating. I'm telling. It's the one thing I've seen. I promise, it's really cool. I'm about to fight him on my second character, which I can show you guys. Uh, okay, so get off of the coin. Yeah, I know. I know how that works. John did it! Yeah. No. Just jump <laughs> off. I'm done. I'm just gonna repeatedly kill Kyle as vengeance. Okay, where is this bullshit? Should be behind you, Kara. Just keep an eye. Jump there. there. Jump. Just go. There, there you go. we go. Um, to your right. To your right. Oh my god. To my right. There we go. Uh, He's right there. Just sitting. Oh, there he is. Mm. Mm. Don't disappear like that. You had me downright worried. Yes, it so take a look in the you. courtyard to the Your left. Epiphany has struck me squared in the head. With the C stick, I've you can still turn. The of this yes, to the left. Lift. Jordan doesn't know his left. Yeah, what, what, what is that? Oh, it's a demon. You're gonna have to fight that. Talk to him again. On some days, I begin to doubt myself. I went up the tower, so I thought, then somehow ended up here. I'm not exactly sure. I don't know how this guy got here. He had to clearly had yeah. jump off the lift while he was still in motion. That, that humongous beast. I'm no coward, and I have a steady hand. But how oh, now? Think twice before you go down that road. So when you go down and start fighting him, he'll go down and help you. Neat. Where's the item? Or is it down there? You have to go up a building and then jump across into a tower. Uh, so basically, you have to kill this guy. Neat. I've never actually fought this boss before, obviously. It's not a boss, I don't think. It's not, it's just a stronger it's just boss. A, yeah. Homeward Bone. Oh. Nah. Every time I see the Homeward Bone, I think of that old movie, Homeward Bound. <laughs> hey, before you laugh, wasn't Michael J. Fox the voice of one of the animals? You should have waited. Yeah, sick word. Dude, okay, do you know why they wear that armor? Why do the onions? Uh, yeah, the onion armor. No. Um, in their town, or their, the main uh, court or enemies that fight them are... Um, oh! I've never seen that attack before. <laughs> yeah, fucking murked you. Well, yeah, obviously. Um, the main enemy that they fight, their main village enemy, uses a lot of rapiers. So they wear weird armor that would make it go and like fly off in the wrong direction. Cool. Yep. I'm going to regurgitate a lot of things my friend from Missouri told me about the lore. Yay! But we're going to have to continue this next time. Woo.